Yo, 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 yo. What's up, what's up, what's up? Na, 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 na. You know what it is. Got another StarCraft Cassie cast for you guys. And I am doing Dorami versus Charles William. And this is Lee Boku, aka Gold CV. <laughs> My friend's in here taking a video of me. So, Dorami, a beast. Um, going for a mech build, so I'm going to do two games with these guys. Uh, two Protoss first turn. I think this is Gold SCB. It could be Toki. There's a small chance it could be Toki. So, we will see. So, here's your barracks. Going into the double factory. There's your scout. So here's the Prub dub coming in here. Gonna get the scout off. Gonna see he's up against a mech, mech build, so went for two gateways and a nexus. And looks like a single gas is gonna come down. Might be double, double gas. So he killed the probe pretty quickly. Let's see what their army's seeing. So here's your two marines, vultures. We'll see if he goes in the vultures or just double machine shop. Here's your third factory. <clears throat> so here's your zealots coming in. Gonna have to micro these guys. Those vultures should be coming out then. And unfortunate for Charles, he's across the map. So we'll see if these zealots do any damage, gonna pull some SCVs, go after the SCVs that are getting gas. There goes one. Nice micro. Gonna get two. Gonna lose a marine, gonna lose two marines. And now I think he's just gonna go right into the double machine shot because he's got the vulture, so he can just micro. And he's gonna put the barracks over the SCV so you can't click on the SCVs. What a little nice trickery right there. Gonna kill it SCV though, so it's a third one. Might get a fourth one. Not going to, but nice little move right there. So those are the things low money players kind of do. So these guys are gonna scout, see if there's any cannon rush. And looks like we got two more gateways on the way. We'll see if he goes for dragoons. He's got a decent amount of gas. Here's here's your vultures. To take out these zots. I think a starport might come down. And let's see what Charles is seeing. Oops. So he didn't see that starport. Oh, it's not a starport, so it's a depot. Let's see if this guy builds a starport. There's your fourth factory. So one thing that I really like about Dorami and Buell is they go for this mech build and they can really push really really fast so here's your barracks lifted up we'll see if he brings an scv on down getting siege mines got two more vultures on the way three more vultures on the way here's your scv gonna probably repair like a little beast here comes your dragoons but two tanks are here gonna lose one vulture gonna lose one dragoon and he's repairing the vulture I mean, Dorami is an absolute beast with Terran. There's your engineering bay. Playing off of one command center. Here's your tanks already sieging up. Let's see what... Yeah, this is... This is cool. That's... Just by the APM, I can tell. Here's your mines coming down. I think you should micro these guys back. Here's your Citadel of a Dune. Got four Dragoons. And well, it's seven dragoons, two zots. Push it in here. We'll see if a turret gets made, or is this guy gonna scout? This guy's gonna come in. So you can see the citadel. And here's your mines getting laid. More mines. So this is not looking good for gold SCV. Let's 
back it up a little bit. This guy's gonna go down. More mines. As soon as these guys pop out. Well, here's DTs coming, but as soon as these guys pop out, they're gonna hit the mines. Here's your starport making a wraith. Tanks are gonna move back a little bit. And here is a DT drop. So, two DTs in there. I don't know if Jeremy saw that. I'll take out that Dragoon, but he's gonna lose one of his. Oh, he's gonna go after the minerals. He's gonna have to pull the probes to the right side. And coming in. Takes out the left side. He's got 25. Look at all those four Dragoons just died right there. Taking out more. If these guys are just chilling right here, they can take out a decent amount of probes. And here's that DT drop. Reaver gonna pop out. So he's got 18 probes, but. Yeah, so Dramian in a really good position. I think he's gonna get a triple command center. He's got one command center coming down, getting more turrets. He's waiting for that DT drop. Here it comes. So here's your DTs right here. Oh, actually, I can't even see them. There's one DT. And now I think you should just go for the attack. Let's see, he's got an armory. Here's your other command center. This is a dropship. You can make a dropship. Here's your mines. So we're going to probably just keep sending out Zealots. I mean, he does have a thousand in the bank, so he's got a reaver drop as well. Here's your Wraith patrolling right here, going back and forth. Yeah, here's your armory. Academy, actually. So, Gold SCV really needs to try to get a drop in. Here's your Vulture, he's going to lay some more mines. Drama is such a beast. His TVP is just... It's right up there with fuels. Especially when you go mech build. Here's your Raid, so he saw that shuttle, but I think he's going to try to take out this shuttle maybe. Decent amount of probes. Hopefully this game is not corrupt. That would stink. Yeah. Got these probes right here. Please don't be corrupt. Uh, I think this game might be corrupt. Let me start it over. Yeah, there we go. Pretty sure. So here's another Nexus coming down. Getting an observatory. Look at all these. I mean, he's just controlling. He's really just controlling Gold SCV's base. I do think he needs to get. Yeah, he's got a decent amount of gas. He needs to get a couple more factories. And did he kill his comm set? Here's a drop right here, reaver drop. These guys are gonna die. Three dragoons and a zealot. So here's your reaver drop. Here's a tank drop. Two tanks in there. Is he accidentally shooting his own shovel? So I'm a little surprised that Dorami's not trying to be more aggressive right now. He's got this tank drop that's coming down here. He's got a reaver drop right here. One tank in the back. And this is where Dorami could get better. Here's your tank drop coming in. And he's at 26 probes. He's going to drop down to 24. Here comes the Reaver drop. And we'll see if Dorami even sees this. Here comes the Reaver. And it's going to pop out. It's going to be behind here. Pulling the SCVs nicely. He got maybe two. So that is going to go down. 
So, I, I mean, I definitely think Dorami should be... He should be more aggressive right now. And... Charles has no idea that there's these mines right there. I think he has an idea, but... He doesn't know exactly where they're at. So, another drop. Let's see what's in here. Four Zealots, a Reaver. So, eight... Eight Zealots, Dragoon, and a Reaver. Let's see what Dorami's got going. So sending these guys over, gonna put some mines on the side, so he's gonna miss this drop. And he's got some rates on the way. Putting some mines over here. Putting some mines everywhere. There's your observer, so now I'm gonna be able to clean out his base and I think he should go for a choke here and just try to macro up so here's your drop coming in and is that there's four armor he's getting made right there pulling the STVs he's got them all hot keyed see there's your reaver gonna take out that tank and this might do some damage he's gonna go after the main But not gonna get it. Pulling the SCVs back. I still think Dorami's in a really good position. He's got more SCVs than than gold SCV has for his pro count. Here's your four armories. Gonna start getting all his upgrades. I mean, I I really think you should just start going for the attack here. Losing three Dragoons right there. Still not doing the best job. Is he, did he forget Dragoon range? Here's your Corsairs. Six gateways. And here's your Templar drop. That's the one thing about Gold SCV is he's got really, really good Templar drops. So yeah, kind of just chilling a little bit. 134 supply to 116. We kill that turret. Building, building a lot more turrets on the side. He's got a bunch coming right here. He's got the wraith on the side. Here's another drop. I think he's gonna go for a double drop. I mean, if he just went for the attack, he can end this game. This is gonna get spotted out by these mines. Here's your scans coming down. I'm gonna see this drop. Ooh. That was pretty quick. I don't know if he saw it. Yeah. <clears throat> so I think he actually did. I think so. He's looking for the drop. And one thing he Dorami has is really, really good Wraith control. There it is. He's going to see the drop. And let's just watch this micro. That other drop's probably going to be coming too as well. He's going to get it. Other drop's coming as well. There's your Templar. And this one got killed as well. So... At 142 supply, he should probably just start moving on out. Yeah, a couple things he needs to improve on, I think, is macroing up his base. He's got 2k and 2k. Um, I'd like to see Dorami. I, I, I'm not sure if he still has been playing fastest only as of recently. So, I mean... He's like one of those players like Buell that will just continue to get better and better and better. Use their low money skills. They just need to learn how to macro up a little bit better. I think one of the best people that's at macroing is probably Shin. So, Gold SCV gonna start moving out and those guys are gonna take a huge hit. A little expo action right here. Here's your move out, those upgrades should be somewhat close. Yeah. So he's going to have one, one for ground and air. Move it out. Let's see if there's any upgrades for... Well, that's if he's going to try to... Or for Dorami. One on shield. Here's your rates. Here's a drop. That one, one should be done. Yep. Nice storm right there. 
Here goes your shuttles. And I mean, yeah, I mean, Gold SCV pretty much has been decimated this whole game. And I think if just Tarami continues to attack, I think he'll have this one. So here's your raids, gonna snipe this out. The shuttles are, look at that little micro action. So good with it. Taking out the Reavers as well. Gonna take out these Corsairs, putting the tanks on the side. I think this one is gonna be over Rover very soon. Probably gonna snipe out that Templar right there. There's your Archon, gone. Let's see how this looks for Gold SUV. He's got an Expo, maybe gonna build a bunch of DTs here. He's got Zealots getting made. I mean, I think he should have just went for a choke. There's raids in his build or in his base. Reavers are gonna go down. He's got no cannons to see these. Here's your vultures coming in. And Yeah, not I mean Durami made this look somewhat easy, but it's not Obviously, it's not easy. Gold SCV is one of the best Protoss in the game. So, here's your tanks rolling in. So, he's gonna just try to bank on this counter, maybe make a Nexus here. And Dorami's already got some tanks over here. He's got some vultures. I think he actually misclicked here. And, probably gonna move these tanks in a little bit closer, get the Probodobes. He's getting his next upgrades. He is. So almost halfway done. And we'll see if the GG gets called. This is why I love the mech build. I mean, it's just so strong early on. If you can really do a lot of damage, there's really not much your opponent can do. I mean, DTs. The way to counter it is... Here's your tanks taking out the probes. The way to counter it is to go for a really quick DT drop. I've seen Brain do it, but um, and uh, Durami, I don't know if he's going to talk some smack right now. He's probably like, why are you not leaving? Because you got this little attack right here. But the scan's coming down and he's going to see that expo. All he really needs to do is just lay some mines back here. Probably lay mines with this guy. I'm trying to micro, he's got rates. I mean, and it's just a drop. Oh, snipe set out. Just had zealots in it though. And he's gonna pull these guys back. I mean, he's got no money, so now I'll do a, a TVP of with the uh, gold SCV on the Terran. So we'll see. Gonna wall this off nicely. Look at this little wall. I mean, just so smart. He knows that as long as he doesn't lose. I mean, he's already got 14k in the bank. There's your GG. GG McGee. So, Dorami gonna win that one. I think they played five games, but I'm just gonna do two of them. I love seeing Dorami's Protoss. I mean, he's just such a unique player. So we will see if this one's any good. I think after this, in the suburb cast, I'm gonna do the Lucky Back versus Brain games. I've been meaning to do those games. They're five Protoss versus Protoss. And uh, I know RJB did them on his channel, but I've actually never seen them, so. So let's speed it up a little bit. Got the Protoss right here. We'll see if Dorami maybe goes for like Dragoons or Go with one gateway, maybe gonna go gateway nexus. I think he's going dragoon, so always switching it up. Here's your forge, though. I don't know what he's going for, actually. This is why he's also another very hard player to play against. Um, this will probably get posted after the games of Lucky Back and Mong, and this is what makes a player like this really hard to play against because. 
you don't you really don't know what they're they're gonna go for. It's, it's whatever they feel like. So the, I mean, he's gonna have. I think he's going for a super fast reaver. He's just got one cannon up here, not getting scouted. And one thing that Gold SCV is pretty good at is he can really um, he can really just kind of like turtle and play the long game. And so we'll see if that's what he does here. Both players playing at 350 APM. Actions per minute. So that's about 61, 20, Yeah, if you play three, if you play at 360, that's six clicks every second, which is insane. Here's your Citadel. He might be going for a Templar drop. Zealot on the way. And this build might even be better if you put the gateway out here and then the cannon, but <clears throat> the only thing is I think you can still take out that gateway possibly. Here's your zealots coming in. Gonna maybe act like he's pressuring, but he's really just buying himself time. Nice little micro from Gold SCV. And Dorami playing at 400 APM. I mean, he's probably gonna build two more cannons here. Yeah, so there's two cannons. Taking a little sip. Gotta get that uh, energy. So yeah, just really trying to buy, him, buy himself time for these cannons to, to finish up. So he's gonna have five cannons here. I don't see any... And... Yeah, I don't see any... Um, Medics here. See, this is a Reaver that's gonna come. He's got two DTs, probably gonna start getting made. There they are. I mean, this is this is probably the fastest DT drop you can go for here. He's got a support bay. He's gonna go Reaver and uh, DTs, I think. We'll see. Here's your medics dropping these guys over here. Gonna try to sneak these on down. Maybe try to kill a turret if you can. Smart little move. They're gonna get spotted out by these fire bats and absolutely get smoked. No pun intended. So here's the gateway coming down. Might build another one right there. Here's your DTs. Does he have a com? He doesn't even have another command center, so. Gonna have to build a turret up here. So he was really trying to bank on busting through the front, but not gonna happen. And he's got the Reaver DT. Is it just a, just a Reaver? Gonna sneak in here. We'll see if he stims these guys up. And Dorami's got really good Reaver Shuttle Micro, so. Gonna snipe out. Ooh. That's gonna save him. The hill. Get out two more fire bats. And smart move to take out. Nice little micro. Smart move to take out the shuttle. And this TT going to go down. This TT, not the best control. So he is going to survive. And I think he's going to yeah, put some a turret here. Probably put a depot. or He's going to put a bunker and a turret. Here's a probadobe. And the one thing that when you go for a build like this, that Dorami did, it kind of slows you, if you if you really don't do a lot of damage, it kind of slows you down. So, you have to go for the triple nexus. Get some cannons around. And, gold SCV just playing, playing the long game, probably going to start building some depots up here. Another bunker. And we'll see what Dorami goes for next. Double Templar drop from both sides. Well, that's if you just playing off of one command center. And I think he needs to get a Stargate. What's up? 
There it is. So he actually is getting a Stargate. Start building some pylons right here. Let's see if these guys have an upgrade. No upgrade yet. Not even getting the upgrade, so. And here comes that drop down here. So he's going to drop here and here. The scans come down. Oops. I don't think so. Gonna siege up this tank. He's got these marines in a good position to stop a drop. And gonna storm this drop. Not gonna get through either. So gonna be completely fine. And yeah, just gonna play the long game. Get another factory. Seems like it's taking him a little time to kind of build up his base, but that's because he went for a command center late. That second one. He's making a third one now. Let's see what Dorami's got going for him. A couple more cannons coming down, getting his gas. Get an upgrade. Two more, ro another robotics. And really just going to wall this off. Here's a couple cannons right here. And this is why I like, another reason why I like a mech build is because it's just, it's more entertaining in the beginning. There's a lot more micro macro action. I feel like when I play like this, it's kind of like just turtling and building up your base, trying to stop drops. And Dorami gonna get three more robotics. Here comes a drop down here. Gonna is it gonna get through Templar? And he is gonna get a storm off. 46 SCVs down to 25. 23 SCV, so nicely done. And I think that Dorami should just build eight, eight gateways right here. Kind of how you see, uh, this guy's tripping out. Kind of how you see Mong do it. He just builds a ton of gateways and then he's just relentless with his pressure. But that's, that's what we saw with, with Mong and Lucky Beck is Mong kind of gets stuck on the same thing. I mean, he doesn't really switch up his game plan after that. And here comes your drop. Is it going to get sniped out? Drop on the Templar first. Going to storm these guys. Going to put this guy on the hill. Try to storm these guys again. Going to get that vision. And storm those guys. Zealot in here. And supply basically is the same, but SCV count to probe count. Dorami's very far ahead. Got the pylons on the side. See any drops? We'll see if he goes for a tank drop. I mean, that's one thing that Gold SCV is pretty good at. Not as good as JH. But he's good at tank dropping. Figure out a spot where he can tank drop and we'll get it in there. So five shuttles. Gonna build a Nexus for more gas. He might transition into carriers. We'll see. But I think he should just go for a bunch of reavers and then just drop right here. Attack with Zealots. Drop a bunch of reavers. Kind of flank this. And then it'll be over. So here's another Templar drop. Reavers in here, Templars, and Zealots. Get this upgrades. There's your Fleet Beacon. Did that drop already come through? I oh, know, it's right here. Okay. So he's got a couple more shuttles coming as well. And there's the scan. So he's gonna see that there's the shuttles are not there, so there's probably a drop coming soon, which is exactly what's happening. So let's see what else is in here. Reaver. So a lot of reavers. There's that scan, and I think he saw it. I'm gonna drop right here, kind of like we saw. And he's gonna go in with the Templar. Go for the drop, and the Templar's gonna storm. Ooh, I don't think he got too many kills, but he's gonna start killing all these depots. See, that's what Mong needs to do. Drop like that, but then also just bring in the Templar drop and sneak it right through. He always just drops everything and just leaves it there. 
And it looks like Gold SCV is going to go for a kind of a big tank drop of his own. So he's just trying to turtle up. Here comes another drop from Durami. And Durami can be pretty relentless with his drops. He's got four top bars in here. And moving these guys up. And this might sneak in. Here it comes. Dropping one top bar. Storm coming down. And not going to get that storm off. So 55 SCVs, 92 probes. He's going to bring these guys on over, get that gas. There's another massive drop. Still making probes. I don't think he needs to make any more probes. He's already got 93. And let's see if some more. Gonna get Yeah, so he's going to get a vessel. He's got one upgrade. Rebuilding all those depots. Stuck at 135 supply. Here comes a drop. And there's your Templar going to die. Going to drop the Zealots on the SCVs. Try to get that splash damage. But not going to get anything done. So yeah, we'll see if Durami switches up his game plan here. Looks like he's gonna get a couple more Stargates. He's got he's gotta get rid of some of his probes. He's already got 2,500 in the bank. Looks like he's gonna bring these guys over. This is a smart move. So he's gonna drop here, pick these guys up, I think. Kill the turrets. Go and pick these guys up. Drop those guys. Here's your tanks right here. The upgrades are one, two, two upgrades. Storming the tanks, but look at all these drop ships. I, I mean, I could see Gold SCV winning this one with a huge drop, just dropping right here. So, if I had to bet, I, I really think that if you can stop this next drop. Maybe move this out a little bit further. Get some vision over here. If you can stop this next drop, skin coming down, he's gonna see this. Stimming these guys up. And there's your Templar, and four Templars in here. I don't know why he's not going for it. Oh, he put him in the other shuttle. Did he split these up? That might go down. There's a Reaver over here. Gonna go pick up that Reaver. Let's get that vision of Durami. Gonna put this guy on the hill. I mean, he's just always doing something different. Drop it on the hill. He's got the Reaver. He's got the Archon. But here's your tank drop. So, ain't gonna try to sneak that in. Durami's a little tr tricky player. Look at it. Look at Golesi putting at 300. He was up to 350 APM. Here's your carriers on the way. So. Yeah, so Drama going to switch into carriers here. But here's a massive, massive tank drop. Let's see. Two, four, six, eight. Ten tanks. Going to maybe have 14. Getting two more. There's another drop. And we'll see if Drama saw that. There's your storm. <coughs> Gonna drop all the way down to 23 SCV, so really got smoked there. But here's your huge drop. Gonna pull the Templars. Coming in. See if he EMPs the Templars instead. Here we go. This is the game decision. He's just gonna drop the tanks. I don't even think he needs to siege these guys. So the main's gonna go down. Is he gonna get it? Oh, he didn't get it. Wow. Did not get the main. So that is huge. And these carriers are going to finish up. So I think that's going to be the GG. He did kill some of the probes. Oh, he did get the main. When did he get the main? I guess I'll have to replay that. 16 minutes and 50 seconds. I'll replay that. Well, here's your carriers. This is 
really walled off. We'll see if he goes for another tank drop. I mean, he can just sneak that in right here, get some probe kills. See if he maybe gets ghosts. Should get a uh, covert ops and then lockdown. Or is he gonna make Valkyries? He's just making more dropships, so. Here comes your carriers, and don't know what Libagu, Libagu is saying here, but here comes your carriers. See if he tries to bring a drop in. I think he is. So you have the carriers kind of distract the turrets, and then you can just sneak in the drop, which is what he's going to do here. Scan coming down, gonna see all these observers. Here's your Marines, gonna absolutely destroy these carriers. Here comes your drop. He's actually gonna storm the Marines. So smart move there. And there's a couple Valkyries that spawned. And some more carriers. I think I think Dorami's gonna have this one. A couple Goliaths coming in though. Here's your carriers. Valkyries. I don't know. I mean, it's going to be close. Getting range for his Goliaths. Putting these guys on the hill. And there's your GG. So, yeah. Dorami going to go 2-0 against Gold SCV. Always playing unique. That's why I like to do replays of him. And uh, he's, a really good, he's really good at dropping. Nice little attempt. Let's just see. Oh, I do want to see... How oh, that main died. Because I could have scored it was at 200 HP. Alright, so here comes your drop. There's your EMP. And let's just watch this. 231. How does this thing die? He killed it himself? What? I wonder why he did that. I don't know if he's just cheesing or something like that, but... Yeah, so... GG right there. I think he maybe he's, he wanted to kill it and then show him that he could still beat him. If he lost his main like that, it didn't matter if he lost his main or not. So, uh, good games right there. Give it a like and subscribe if you're not subscribed. And uh, I'll talk to you guys later. Have a good one. Peace.